Hello there. Thanks for tuning in. In this short session, we will discuss the Track 1140, which is a new tracker we are adding to our Ancelus portfolio as part of our seasonal update for the winter 2023. A short recap at Senseless, this is what we do. We create great battery power trackers, which you can equip on your valuable assets. These are all connected to our cloud-based platform. And there we have a great solution to visualize, to analyze the complete location, movements, usage patterns of your assets. So looking back at the past year, what have we done at Census? We have developed a complete NBIoT tracker portfolio. With complete, we mean that we have a solution for different types of use cases, which require a different type of tracker with a different price point as well, with different features and technologies that can be used. We already had available at the start of 2023, these Track 1100, which is our flagship tracker, our most feature-rich tracker offering the broadest range of localization technologies and also extra features like connecting Bluetooth sensors. So this offers a GPS solution, it offers Wi-Fi localization and it offers for indoor localization also the Bluetooth geo beacon detection. In spring this year we have also added the Track 1110 which is a smaller form factor and BAOT tracker so specifically if the physical size of the Track 1100 would not be suitable for your specific kind of assets. Then we offer the Track 1110, which is smaller. It needs to sacrifice a little bit of battery lifetime, obviously, for that. But other than that, it has the same features as the Track 1100. We have also added a lower cost solution, which is the Track 1130. This one does not have uh, the GPS solution. Um, but it is a Wi-Fi sniffing only solution, so very suitable for rural environments and having less of the features. It is a lower cost solution compared to its flagship tracker. And now here in December, we are also adding another type of yeah, sharply priced solution, lower cost solution, which is a Track 1140, which only offers um, GPS and Bluetooth Geo Beacon localization. So let's zoom a little bit in on this new Track 1140. What does it offer? It has the same form factor as the Track 1100, so same um, IP rating and industrial strengths, but for localization technologies, as we just mentioned, only GPS for outdoor localization, and when indoor, it will try to fall back to. Bluetooth Geo Beacon. So this requires that there is uh, some light infrastructure installed on the specific sites where you expect the assets to be indoor, meaning that you will need to install these battery powered Geo Beacons on these locations. It offers up to 10 years of battery lifetime depending on use case and as already mentioned, as a, the casing and the physical dimensions are industrial strength great. It features an accelerometer, which it uses to detect start of movement and stop of movement and perform the localizations at exactly these times, in addition to periodic localization, which can also be enabled. And it offers the tilt detection feature, which is also present on the Track 11. And as all of our trackers, it is easy to self-install in less than a minute. And the behavior is extremely configurable to match your specific use case. A typical use case is, for example, a asset, a container, which is the majority of time positioned outdoor. Thanks to the GPS, you have localization when the asset is in outdoor position or when it is in transit. And at occasional times when this asset is indoor and you would want to have localization indoor there you would equip bluetooth geo beacons to enable the indoor localization if we compare in more detail the differences with the track 1100 on the left side which is the flagship tracker and the 1130 which is the nbot uh, sorry which is the wi-fi only tracker 
Here we can see some of the differences. So the Track 1140 does not have Wi-Fi localization. It does not have the capability to connect additional BLE sensors. Also, the Cupa High Precision localization cannot be enabled on this type of tracker. It's maybe interesting, as you would have noticed, that we have two lower cost options um, that we position, right? So let's compare them because you might want to know yeah, which tracker is now really suitable for my use case. So it's worth spending some extra time on comparing the Track 1130 and Track 1140. Kind of a busy slide, but keep in mind that right, the Track 1130 on the left-hand side is a Wi-Fi only localization. So there we target mostly indoor localization use cases. It requires that Wi-Fi is available on each site can also be used in outdoor urban areas or suburban areas where yeah, Wi-Fi networks are omnipresent anyway. Um, on the other hand, if you have mainly outdoor use cases, there the Track 1140 would be a much more suitable solution. So if the minority of the location points is indoor and the number of indoor sites is limited, the Track 1140 would be a more suitable solution for you. Um, also, we are comparing here, let's say the hardware price per use per unit. You can see, you will see that the uh, hardware price per unit for the Track 1130 is actually lower than the Track 1140. On the other hand, there is a substantial cost of Wi-Fi localization, which is yeah, not very not a tremendous cost, but if you count it over the years and over all the assets, it becomes significant. And it may be a bit counterintuitive, but overall, you would actually see that if you calculate the total cost of ownership, the hardware, lower hardware cost is actually compensated by the total cost of Wi-Fi resolution subscriptions uh, over time, right, compared to the uh, higher initial cost in hardware price of the Track 1140, but the Track 1140 then does not have this fraction of Wi-Fi resolution subscription associated over time. So um, yeah, just a quick reminder to always do a full calculation of the total cost of ownership before you make a purchase decision or you make a specific choice for a specific product. So having said that, we're wrapping up this short introduction of the Track 1140. If you want more information, be sure to check out our website where you can find the complete portfolio of our trackers. Reach out to one of our partners or reach out to Senseless if you want more specific information on our products and on our solutions. Thank you and until next time.